once you find your location then you want to align your pick one contamination or any dust or anything that you can crack that can act as a clue for calibrating your machine pick that I'm going to pick like one of these particles small particles then switch to high mag by pushing this do your auto brightness and contrast now bring that thing into the middle by navigating bring that contamination or that dust on the middle of the screen then by using your uh, using your focus knobs try to focus on your sample I'm turning this so I'm just focusing on the sample see now I'm on focus on my sample then I can go in try to increase my magnification as you can see I'm increasing my magnification on the sample and then by focus course and find right now I'm turning the course one to find a better focus location if you are focused at around 10,000 then you can start your alignment try to be at 5k and then push your alignment button first thing as we talked about this before make sure the beam pass through exactly the center of your column by these two X and Y you can control where the beam is so you can bring it to the middle exactly in the middle next thing is the aperture line make sure your aperture line you should see in and out right now you can see it's not going in and out I am I have this kind of movement on my image so I need to adjust both X and Y to make my aperture align I will start from X by turning X I try to see if I can right now it's going this side on the egg ray direction now it's the time that I can use the other knob so I turn the other knob now it's going in and out and there's no movement that means the microscope is aligned I can increase my magnification and check it for higher magnification and see if I can do a better alignment next it's to do the stigma make sure there is no X and Y movement so adjust that stigma break same thing and then you close your window that's the alignment of this microscope then you can do your astigmatism which I'm going to show you how you adjust your astigmatism manually on the next video